I think it's really the, the attention of Carol Baskin and Big Cat Rescue and Tiger King that helped push this new law over the finish line. And that new law, the Big Cat Public Safety Act, aims to protect big cats from trade and abuse. Tonight, two, S rep uh, two U.S. representatives are celebrating the law with Big Cat Rescue owner Carol Baskin and her husband Howard. As News Channel 8's Brittany Muller shows us, big cat owners are now required to register their animals before the deadline, which is just nine days away. Carol Baskins of Big Cat Rescue here in Tampa has been advocating for these big cats for decades. Baskin says this law is surreal by changing history, saving cats from abuse and extinction. The first cat that we will probably see will be Duchess. She's in two and a half acres in that enclosure right there. Carol Baskin gave us a tour of Big Cat Rescue in Tampa. So she can never be set free, unfortunately. Baskin says the Big Cat Public Safety Act is the first step of trying to save apex predators in the wild. It finally ends the private ownership of big cats and some of the most egregious forms of abuse of these cats so that we can now pivot and focus on saving these cats in the wild where they belong. The law also puts an end to cub petting. Congressman Mike Quigley of Illinois sponsored the bill, hoping rescues aren't needed in the future. It was really twofold, help protect these majestic beasts and protect our communities and our first uh, responders. Quigley and Congresswoman Kathy Castor credit the advocacy and sacrifice of the Baskins since 1992. I was an attorney that represented them in the very early days, over 20 years ago, and have watched this uh, refuge grow. And unfortunately, it's, it's grown because too many people have been abusing these big cats. The sanctuary was home to over 200 big cats at one point. So this is empty, all of that's empty. Now only 39 are left. As a result of this law, Baskin announced she plans on closing and moving the big cats to Turpentine Creek Wildlife Refuge, an accredited sanctuary in Arkansas. We will pay for their care there until they die of old age, but it allows us then to sell this property and use that money for conservation. The deadline to register big cats is on June 18th. Big cat owners could face prison and fines if they don't register by that deadline. In Tampa, Brittany Muller, 8 on your side.